All right, I just beat the third gym and now Don's gonna yell at me for help with something. All right, now we will multi-battle versus Team Galactic once again. It's amazing how much you can make yourself bounce just by flexing your butt cheeks. Thunderbolt the Beautifly, done. I didn't realize Team Galactic so used so many of the Hoenn bugs. Stunky down, Thunderbolt is so amazing. I can't believe they're just selling those at the department store. It makes me so happy. All right, we defeated Team Galactic, and then I get Fly after this, right? Please? No? I don't get Fly yet? Oh. Oh! Wow, okay. I got the TM, and it gave me the HM. That's... <laughs> I've never experienced that before. There's gotta be an easier way to do the fly thing. Well, whatever. A wild Staraptor! Thank you, friend! Oh, the egg is finally hatching. Look at it bouncing. Oh, it's bouncing, it's moving. And it's a happini, as predicted. Why'd they give it a weird bulbous unibrow? I don't understand that design decision. All right, well, I'm here in Mount Coronet, and now I just have to level up Magneton. Hopefully this doesn't take too long. A few moments later. Oh, am I not getting any nibbles? A little longer than a few minutes later. Excuse me? Eventually. Finally. All that work for a Magikarp! That is not gonna work. <laughs> uh. What is happening? Now I can't get any Pokemon just running around. There we go. Oh God. Oh, it's so slow. You know what? I, I, I'm using the rare candy and it works, it works! Magnezone. Oh, the power, it flows through me. Had to kick so much booty, oh my god. South we go, down to Pastoria City. This guy's glasses are, uh, I, I don't like him. Hemlock wants to be petted. Hemlock, you're very sweet, but you're literally covered in poisonous thorns. Man, in the Sinnoh Pokedex, there's only two fire types, but you sure see a lot of these ponytas. And this guy's a collector and he just has three ponytas because they're just, they're so rare. <laughs> I feel like I'm probably far south enough to get to the next section of the underground. That is uh, not correct. No, I am not far enough south. Oh, I see my little effect from my statues. The ghost types apparently are more common now. All right, I made it to Pastoria City. What an interesting little Krogunk statue they have on the counter. Can I purchase that? No, but I can purchase Quick Balls. All right, I now have a reliable place to buy Quick Balls, the best Pokeball in the game. And it's gonna make me so much more eager to catch Pokemon that I have not yet caught for the Pokedex. But one thing I'm gonna do is the Great Marsh. Do I have a limited number of steps like before? And look at me, <laughs> look at me running at top speed through the mud and not getting any Pokemon. There we go, whoopa, Quagsire. Okay, let's see if we can catch you. And I got the Quagsire, let's go. A Meryl, yes. Come to Bubba. Let's go. Hey, there's Barboach. Got it, let's go. All right, lots of Pokedex entries on this trip. Well, um, oh, I was just about to say I'm, <laughs> Getting, I'm ready to leave. That was amazing. Huh. Ha ha, it is I, Grunty Boy. And you are still playing this silly game. Well, um, I don't know what level the gym is. It doesn't even have Team Rocket in it. it uh, never mind. Since he's obviously in a world of his own, I'll instead tell you about the game I've been excited about recently, the sponsor of this video, Dungeon Fighter Online. I'm feeling pretty good about my team. I've got like, I've got a really ripped team. Well, I'll try and hopefully this nerd doesn't keep interrupting me. Dungeon Fighter Online is a classic beat em up action MMORPG with an epic storyline. Choose from 16 classes and unravel ancient mysteries as you slice, blast, punch, or magic your way through enemies. It doesn't have a full team of six yet. I'm still trying to figure out the last one because Spiritomb may not happen because that is, I don't know what's going on. You are being so rude. Anyways, the new update will introduce the new female Slayer character advancement, Spectre. The Spectre uses her fast mobility skills made possible by her specialized wires to defeat enemies with rapid sword strikes. Through the new storyline and quests, you can follow her journey for vengeance. But, I mean, we could check out the gym. Speaking of vengeance, I'm going to need it against you for continuing to interrupt me. With the launch of Spectre, there's also a level up event that allows you to level a Spectre character to max level while getting rewarded with various gear, including the best grade mythic gear. They're also running the Newbies Always Welcome event, which is perfect for newcomers and lets you team up with veteran users in dungeons and raids to get big benefits and rewards. Plus some just for logging in. Witness. It is wet, look at me. I'm sloshing it around. Oh, there's actually a little bit of water physics. Oh my God, fine, I will leave. But before I do, 
Those of you watching should check out Dungeon Fighter Online by using my link in the description below. But for now, ta-ta! Oh, he threw out his Pokeball on the fishing rod. That was cool. I didn't notice that with previous ones. Oh my God, he's enormous. Look at him. He, <laughs> his Chibi is so big. Look at his arms. Oh my God, he's, I just crash or wake. What an imposing figure. Okay, I decided to lead with Magnezone predicting he leads with Gyarados and he does lead with Gyarados, let's go. I gotta say his posture right now is very intimidating. The Gyarados is only 27. Are his Pokemon the same level as Maylene's? If so, I'm glad I went straight here. I will not switch my Pokemon because I'm doing this as if it was set battle style, which means we are switching out now. Cool battlefield though. Bloodshot as predicted, neutral damage. We take that well. What is that, speed? That's fine. We're probably still faster, I feel like. Giga Drain! Take that HP back, thank you. Bye-bye. The final Pokemon, Lotzel. Giga Drain again. It's faster, Ice Fang. If we live this though, I think we're good. Oh, we live it, we live it! Let's go! Way to go, Hemlock! Is he crying? Oh, what's what's going on with his arm? Oh, dude, that you might want to get that checked out. The Fen Badge, woo! Defog, wait. <laughs> I still, I still can't use strength? Where do I get the HM for defog? You're supposed to blow something up now, right? Yep, now I chase this guy. But first, I'm gonna try going to the underground one more time. I keep hitting Y. Why did they change the registered item to plus? It's so confusing. Am I far enough south? No. Do you maybe have to go there from Sunny Shore specifically? That's my theory. I'm still chasing the grunt. What are you doing? I'm trying to stop a galactic grunt, you fool! Barry, why is it still a Starly? It's level 26, man. It evolves at 14. You've pressed B for 12 levels and what for? Barry, I am so like unimpressed with you right now. I'm not even gonna switch out my fire type. You went for growl on a special attacking Pokemon when you could have gone for a fire move. You outsped me, but no, you clearly have no skills and I have to crush you as a result. Prinplop, why not bring out your grass type first? I'm going to kill you. You're dead. What are you doing? I could tell you raised your Pokemon to be tough. Obviously. Well, there it is. There it goes. Oh, flash cannon, let's go. Yeah, Barry, gonna be real with you, man. Um, What just happened? You're telling me I lost? Yes, I am. All right, back to chasing that grunt. Running down a galactic grunt. Clearly I'm in better shape than he is cause he's the one panting. Giving up yet? No. No, he's not giving up yet. Oh, a team galactic battle, not on the galactic battlefield. Maybe it only does that when you battle them indoors. Well, he ran off and <gasps> Cynthia, hey girl. No one must enter the chamber of that Pokemon, but what if I did anyways? Yes, I have seen the Psyduck. Yes, use the medicine. I got the secret medicine, yeah. Okay, well now I know I can head there, but I need defog first and I'd also like surf. So I am, not gonna do that until I've beaten Fantina, which is probably gonna be the hardest gym battle so far because I don't actually have any darker ghost types. I'm Night Slash though. Got a singular dark type move. I gotta say the Poketch. Oh my God, I was <laughs> I was trying to pull out the item finder because I knew there'd be a hidden item here and I accidentally pressed A instead of R to make it bigger. All right, hello. Are those cookies? Can I have some? You find 10 shards of the same color. Okay, darn it. I don't know what technical machines they are. Well, maybe that thing on the wall will say. Sunny day, rain dance, sandstorm. Okay, it's just the weather TMs. The mansion. What got going on in here, right? Isn't there like the wild Pokemon out back? What's in the trophy garden? Well, that's certainly not anything I was potentially maybe excited to find. Well, there's Pichu, Pikachu, and okay. Well, I'm done here. <laughs> oh, this is where you get a Soothe Bell. Maybe Cheryl only gives you the Soothe Bell that early in Platinum. Yet another platinum improvement that they threw away. And this is why I wasn't gonna use a Budu. Get a Roselia, bypass the insanely lengthy friendship thing. You're quite nervous to battle a young trainer like me? That's fair, I will destroy you. And take all of your wealthy old lady money. $8,000. <laughs> oh my God. Amulet coin, you have been so good to me. All right, well, after that trip that 
honestly could have been completely skipped. Aside from the money from the old people, that was great. I am back in Hard Home City and I'm gonna take on the ghost gym. I'm getting these gym badges in pretty rapid succession, but I will say this gym is the one that I'm the most nervous for. If I had gotten the spirit tomb, then I'd feel pretty good, but I don't have a spirit tomb and my only move super effective against ghost types is night slash on Gliscor. What am I supposed to do here? Why is she not here? Wait, what? I have the other gym badges. Okay, I see now that the flag is here, that I maybe have to do this first. All right, I'm using the secret medicine now. Hey girl, can I ask you a big favor? I want you to deliver this old charm. Do I deliver the old charm before I fight Fantina? Wait, 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 don't leave. I don't have defog. Okay, I, uh, I looked it up and I missed it. So after we finish this battle, I gotta go back to Pastoria and talk to someone at the reception desk at the Great Marsh because that was obvious. Oh, I have to talk to that NPC in the game. I have to enter the Great Marsh. $500 down the drain. Uh, okay, okay, there we go. Whoa, wait, it's, oh my God. It's so bad, they don't even let you see. I just have this scyther in my party. Once I hatch the egg, I just put it back because it's like, ah, oh, what if I need false swipe? <laughs> it's just getting levels. <laughs> $13,000 from that, my goodness. Yes, Howler, ascend to your final form. Infernape. Oh, it looks so angry. Ooh, calm down, buddy, I'm your friend. Also, I haven't commented on it yet, but these little sprites slash drawings that they have of the Pokemon in like the summary pages, they look really good. They look totally new and they look great. All right, Infernape, let's embarrass an ace trainer. Well, let's really embarrass him, wow. <laughs> With a great strategy. Dude, you're a fire type <laughs> against a Mothim. <laughs> yeah, see, we're fine. In Onyx, like I care. Infernape looks really good. Like this 3D model, like with the shading and stuff, it works really well for it. All right, we're almost, oh, come on, man, I'm almost there. All right, I finally made it to Celestic Town, which is exciting because I think the middle segment of the underground is accessible from here. Down we go and, oh, let's go. Look at this. It's totally different walls with crystals and everything. This looks awesome. There's only three hideaways, but like, I gotta check them out. An icy cave? There's some, a deep sea scale. Oh, okay. Maybe there's some Pokemon I could get. Maybe my sixth team member could be an ice type that I find in here. Would have to reset the spawns. It's just Banerian bronze ore. I don't know. All right, here's the big center one. And it is Dazzling. No, Stargleam. I saw Metatite. We've got Ghastly. A nugget, cash money flow. There's the other one in the other segment, and then there's this one. And the only Pokemon I've seen in it are Metatite and Ghastly, which is like, oh, Dragon Pulse. Oh, okay, cool. Anyways, that's uh, a little disappointing that this very cool hideaway has two Pokemon that are very easy to get. <laughs> Stop chasing me. Ah! All right, the last hideaway down here is another Dazzling one. Interesting. Giraffarig, hey, you're new. Please just get in the quick ball. I don't wanna mess with this. Level 35. It's as buff as my team, my God. Dang it. Are you kidding me, Giraffe Rig? Dude, this is the last thing I was gonna do in this recording session. I have an appointment to get to. Oh my God, hypnosis just cannot hit. I've used it only twice and it's missed both times. Oh for three, what on earth? Land a hypnosis. It's not that hard, it's like 70, per four, four total misses. What? Oh, it's only 60% accurate. I thought it was like 70. Oh my God, finally I landed. I just catch Giraffe Rig. I need to go. <laughs> no, come on. Bruh. Are you kidding me? Oh, oh, you're making me real mad, Giraffe Rig. You're making me real mad. Clearly this is not, I mean, is Ultra Ball better? It's like I'm catching a freaking legendary Pokemon. Okay, I got it. Thank you, Jesus. <laughs> All right, a new day. Time to deliver an old charm to an old lady. But there's a spaceman blowing things up. Must stop this galactic man from blowing up this town for no reason. You freaking, like that's just so evil. <laughs> well, that was really easy. His Pokemon are like 10 levels lower than mine. Grandma. The ancient cave painting is this all about? There's 
tiny little creatures. Opposing this being were three Pokemon, kept balance. Is this Surf? Yeah, it is. Hard home gym badge. Okay, now I can fight Fantina. Oh my God, there he is. There appears to be an insignificant struggle. My name is Cyrus. Okay, now he introduces himself. Weird dude. Hey, they sell some good Pokeballs here. Oh, by the way, if you've watched this far into the video, you probably like the content I make, so you should totally subscribe. Damn and JTV Blaze, if you haven't already. All right, finally time to take on the ghost gym with no darker ghost moves except Night Slash on my Gliscor. <laughs> oh, right, it's this puzzle. What is three plus five plus seven? That's 15. Why is this the ghost puzzle? I see why they changed it in Platinum. What does math have anything to do with ghosts? All right, well, no idea what level she's gonna be, but I'm feeling pretty good about this. So, um, let's see how this goes. Oh, ho, ho. <laughs> finally, you have arrived. Isn't she French, right? Is this a French accent? Since I came to this region, I always try to learn new things. The whole contest shows in this city, I say to myself, anything I will accept. The same whole name, porn for Dude, what the heck is French? How does C E S T. Whatever. Bonjour, Antina. She's so tall. Oh, this battlefield is really cool. Digging the stained glass. All right, Driftblim's the lead. Lyscore goes first, and she is. Only 32, yeah, come on guys. What is this level curve? And it's dead. I did get a crit. Owie, I'm gonna use dig for you cause you're weak to ground in this generation. Oh, that's not great. Okay, now I have to not hit myself two turns in a row. <gasps> Nuts. Whoa. Oh no, you snapped out. Yes, let's go. And it's faster. So that misses, now I hit the dig. Booyah! It is your final Pokemon. There's the Miss Magius, level 36. I don't know how this is gonna go, but I think I'm faster? Never mind. Come on, buddy. Come on, stealth. You can snap out of this. You can hit it. Believe in yourself! Mm. Stealth is probably going down here. Yeah, that's that's fine. Uh, I'm gonna bring in Flux. I mean, it's just neutral damage, but like, it's holding the amulet coin, so I will get double money now. Thunderbolt? and the battle is over. All right, five badges down. Oh, hey, Cynthia. Oh yeah, <laughs> it's, it's no problem, you know, no big deal. All right, telling me to go to Cantalave City. But what about the interesting places where I can surf? Before I move on to Cantalave, I wanna poke around some of the places I can get to now that I can surf. I think I might head over to the Rominus Park area. I know I won't be able to like do anything, but I wanna check it out. Maybe there'll be some cool items. Okay, I made it to land. I wonder what Pokemon are in the grass here. Skunk tank, cool. Nice, another X scissor TM. Okay. Oh, I didn't even see this trainer here. Dang it, I was gonna leave. <laughs> All right, off we go. Westward ho. Now I am pretty sure my rival challenges me when I walk up. Yep, there he is. Hi, Barry. How is that not a Staraptor yet? Dude. Oh no. Barry, you troll. Yes. Oh, way to go, Flux. Whew. You know, for Barry's weird inability to battle well, I gotta give him respect for getting the honey tree Pokemon. He clearly spent a lot of time doing that. I don't have the patience for that. All right, check this out. Pro gamer strats. Woo. Chip damage. Gotten out of tighter spots than this plenty of times before. How does it get tighter than you having one Pokemon against a full team of six? Barry, you're done. All right, so I think I can fight the gym leader immediately, but I think I kinda wanna check out Iron Island first. Another interesting thing I wanna check out is that there's a segment of the underground I haven't been able to access yet, and I know you can get to it from Snow Point, but I am wondering if you can get to it from Iron Island as well. Let's find out. Nope. Okay, it has to be snow point. Yeah, I'm not far enough north. Oh well. Hey, there he is. Hey, Riley. Woo, me and Riley. And some bros. Me and tiny Riley. I'm just gonna spam Dazzling Gleam unless they have a poison type on the field. Yep, that works. I gotta trace the Krogunk's anticipation and shuddered. And then the Krogunk shudders at mine. <laughs> There's so much going on. It just occurred to me that the two Pokemon that Riley and I have been using are two of the most furry bait Pokemon in the entire game. <laughs> and we're just both kicking butt with them. <laughs> we're butting all the Pokemon from this rusted out Iron Island. I mean, I don't know if that's illegal, but I'm still gonna crush you just as punishment for your terrible haircuts. It's just occurring to me, I don't think I've faced a female grunt this whole time. All right, I will psychic the Zubat. You force palm the Glam Yeah. Yes. Good boy. Good boy, Riley. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Oh, that was actually fine. I keep forgetting this is, ow. <laughs> okay. You better heal me after this last battle. Glad to help you, Riley. I will take the egg. I will add it to my party, sure. I'm not gonna use Lucario, but the Scyther's just been sitting here. <laughs> and now for the item. 
That was my true purpose of coming here. The shiny stone. All right, Hemlock. Got my very own, very cool Rose Raid. I just need to get a poison move for it. And I looked it up. The Sludge Bomb TM is in the Galactic Hideout or building in Veilstone. So I will get that. I just have to wait for it. All right. Cantilave Gym. Ooh, this battle arena looks cool. Oh no, Steelix has Sturdy. That's a problem for my fire type. And it went for Ice Fang. It is something I need to keep in mind when fighting the gym leader, Steelix, though. I, it probably has Sturdy, and therefore I can't just Oko it. I might end up using Gliscor more just because it's not gonna be weak to the ground moves that some of Byron's Pokemon will know. Byron, I will defeat you on this very precarious platform. Oh, yes, I have defeated your son. That's no surprise. <laughs> oh, someone's got daddy issues. Bronzor. Oh, I thought he had Bronzong. Okay, well, this thing is dead. One flamethrower. Yep, that does it. And then here comes the Steelix. Moment of truth. Does it have Sturdy? With the flamethrower burn it, does have Sturdy. Okay, well, let's see if it kills me. Mm -hmm. Oh. <sighs> That sucks. All right, I don't want to die. I think he's going to heal. Yeah, this is what I got to do, because otherwise I might get. Yeah, OK, if I dig and I don't hit him this turn, then I won't break the sturdy because I thought he was going to heal. And then I might get stuck underground with a with an earthquake. Wait, no, I'm a flying type. Duh, I don't have to worry about that. OK, now we dig. Oh, it's not enough. Why are you so beefy, dude? This should not do anything. That did more than I would have preferred, but it's fine. We just dig again. All right, dig lands, the Steelix goes down. All that's left is the Bastiodon. I am pretty sure this thing has Sturdy as well. So I'm gonna Night Slash it first. I don't think it can do anything that's really gonna hurt me. Okay, well, it's not gonna hurt me, but it's gonna upset me. Maybe I'll crit? It is four times super effective. Okay, now he's at plus four defense. So that's fun. All right, assuming no more iron defenses and he actually tries to attack, okay. Well, now he's at plus six defense and we're just gonna have to live with that flash cannon. Okay, I'm not really worried about that. This thing has physical attack, it's better, right? All right, high damage roll or a crit. I think I need it to KO here. I don't think I KO normally. Yep, that's not great. That's, that's not great. Okay, well, maybe he won't heal. Never mind. I'm actually having problems. <laughs> I might lose Gliscor. I think Rose Raid could handle it. Oh, I got the crit! Oh, but the sturdy. Oh, and he KOs me here. No! Dang it! Okay, it's fine. Hemlock has got this. It's my last Pokemon for a fair battle, but Hemlock has got this. Should be faster. He either heals here or I KO it here. And I win, okay, okay. Wow, all right. Whew. That gym battle was actually, uh, that was a good one. My sturdy Pokemon defeat. Yes, yeah, seriously, the sturdy. That was that was all the problems. If you got if you didn't have sturdy on Bastiodon and Steelix, I would have crushed you with just Inferno. Kudos, Byron. That was the trickiest gym battle so far. Oh! I'm fine. Now we're going to the library, right? I'll meet you there. I got to heal my squad. I want to spend my vacation at the library. I like how we're just doing free labor for him. He sends him to like Acuity because he needs a tough trainer. It's like, dude, I've beat him so many times. Oh, the bomb. I'll do it again, something big just happened. They say there was a huge explosion at Lake Valor. Kaboom, like that. <laughs> all right, Lake Valor, time to see it all blown up. Oh, I like the, the fiery smoke that's left over. For the longest time, I thought Saturn was a girl <laughs> when I was a kid, but now I can tell he's very much just a creepy dude. Since when you have a Kadabra, I thought you just had Bronzor and Toxicroak. And that comes in immediately, so that's that's fun. I think I can just still KO it with a Night Slash, though. Oh no, I can't. I'm gonna go ahead and assume this is a Levitate Bronzor and just keep clicking Night Slash. God, that does so little. I'm gonna swap to Infernape. I know this is against a Psychic type, but I don't think it can do much damage to me. And this way I can Flamethrower it. And then I think his Toxicroak is gonna have Dry Skin. Bronzor goes down. Hello, Toxicroak. Flamethrower! Way to go, Howler. I'm here. Mars! And your very weird skirt. I like how she's like, you don't remember me? Fine, I'll remind you. Hi, I'm Mars. <laughs> Leads with Golbat this time. This is an easy Psychic. Bronzor, unfortunately, I can't really touch. Should I teach you Shadow Ball? I feel like I should teach you Shadow Ball. Anyways, let's switch to Howler so I can flamethrower this and close combat the Perugly. Wow, you are landing crits like every time because you love me. You can tone it back, man. Booyah. Got you, Mars. All right, 
Well, despite defeating them, they still succeeded in capturing Mesprit. So clearly I am late, but you have all three. Wait, I thought you don't officially get Yuxi until I show up at Lake Acuity. Well, it seems now it's finally time for the brutal trek to Snowball. 